This right here is a little passion fruit that had fallen to the ground. Okay, a green passion fruit. And it's ripened to just a little bit yellower than green. I don't know if this is actually a ripe one, but this is what it looks like. So I've got several more out on the vine and they are doing really well. I'm going to give this a little taste and see what it tastes like. I don't know, you guys. What do you think? Mmm, it smells really good. Mmm, mmm. Oh, yeah. Very sweet. It's a little one. It doesn't have a whole lot of stuff in it, but it's sweet. It smells so good. Oh, my gosh. Mmm, 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 mmm. You know what? I love passion fruit. Oh, yeah. I'm definitely going to keep growing this stuff. Oh, you guys, this is really, really good. Uh, uh, uh. I got to get a spoon and get this all out. This is what I had for breakfast. It's kind of like, well, it's applesauce fritters slash pancakes. Little bit more substantial than a pancake. And you can just pick them up. They're covered in uh, cinnamon sugar because I've got a lot of applesauce. And these things are delicious. Mmm. Crunchy on the outside. Moist on the inside. Delicious. Maybe I'll do a cooking video sometime and uh, show you how I did them. There's only two left. I could tell you. I made about a dozen. <laughs> and Papa got a couple. Oh, these are really, really good. Hey, everybody, Ann here. It is way past coffee. I've been up since 4.30 in the morning. I was anticipating my day. So excited. I've already been out cutting up wood because I'm trying to beat the heat. I'm just inside taking a little break right now. So I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you what I got done so far, and then I'm going to do some more. I cut up a couple small logs. I've got another one on there. And inside the shed... All of the wood that I cut up yesterday, I put, well, I stacked up here. If you remember, it was like way down to here. I have built this up again after I moved some of the wood over here that is newer, um, or older, rather. So I brought this up, and I put a bunch of pieces here. So basically all of that I did last night. About half of that stack I did last night, about a quarter of that stack I did last night, and it just keeps growing. Once I get this area all stacked up and all that pallet filled up and really high, at least high enough so it won't fall down, I'm going to start stacking wood here. Yeah, there's some plastic down there. That's just old wood. It's just rotted. I mean, it's dry, but um, I'll stack wood on top of that and just fill this part up. And then I get to fill this part up. I don't know what I'm going to do about that cedar because I want to be able to find the cedar. Um, I may move it somewhere. I don't know. Maybe not. Who knows? But my wood pile is growing. There is nothing left to do aside from just cut me up some more wood. I got my dad's old coveralls on and you can't see, but there's a belt because they're, this is too long and I can't hold them up. But I, I'm not tucking them into my boots because one thing I did learn yesterday is all those shavings get into my mud boots and I don't like it. So you'll see me in this getup. I look it. I look like Mrs. Beasley, don't I?
I think it's time for that uh, chain to be sharpened. I don't know how to do it. My son gave me a tool, but neighbor dude did it once already, and he told me he would teach me how to do it. So I think I'm going to take a break, and I'm going to go ahead and split some of this up. You can probably tell I'm exhausted. I've used that uh, cast iron splitter and cut up pieces of wood that size before. I didn't have any problems. I'm just getting tired. So I'm going to shut her down for today. I did want to tell you I have two prezzies that I'm going to share with you in the next video. They are wonderful from wonderful people. But for now, I'm going to lay down and take a nap because I'm tired. So that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.